Since the adoption of the UN trafficking protocol, most efforts to address exploitation of migrant workers have focused on human trafficking as the most significant form of abuse. Unfortunately, even with hundreds of millions of dollars spent every year to counter trafficking, there's very limited evidence to suggest the problem has been reduced. In this article, I present the case for increasing attention to a range of labor rights violations falling into the category of wage theft. Wage theft relates to the denial of compensation or benefits for a worker to whom they are owed or entitled. It's a particularly common form of abuse against migrants for a number of reasons. First, globalization has led to the creation of business models which are heavily dependent on various forms of wage theft, both inside and outside of supply chains a key motivation for employing migrants is to keep labor costs as low as possible. Second, restrictive labor migration governance regimes establish a relationship of dependency that is easily exploited. Decreasing the ability of migrants to avoid, seek redress, or leave from abusive situations has supported the defrauding of wages as a standard function of these governance systems. Third, Migrant workers are more commonly employed in work which is not fully covered by labor and social protections. In particular, the global trend we're seeing towards increased outsourcing and misclassification of employment has led to a decline in the labor rights provided to migrants. Within my analysis, I contend that addressing the problem of exploitation of migrants more effectively requires a clear focus on the reasons why these abuses occur. The trafficking discourse has framed this issue as resulting from criminality, which I suggest distracts from the broader structural vulnerabilities to abuse that most migrant workers experience. I conclude that expanding the focus on everyday abuses against migrants is essential to developing a more practical response. Interventions to prevent and remediate wage theft would contribute to better working conditions for the vast missing middle who experience more commonplace forms of exploitation. Ensuring a more equitable distribution of wages would also redirect attention to a core issue at stake in the era of globalization, the expansion of economic and social justice for migrant workers.